he he he. I am going to sneak out of my bedroom and I am going to steal my dad's car and go to Peter and Devon's house. Dang it. I forgot that dad turned on the door alarm. I locked the door so Sam won't come in. Mike, you had better open this fucking door before I kick down the door and kick your ass. Well, Mike, you now have another charge for sneaking your ass out of bed. I told you not to get out of bed, mister. I told you, if you got out of bed for anything, I would give you fucking poop for lunch and dinner. Get your fat ass back to bed. Dad, I have to go to the bathroom. I don't give a shit. You do not leave the bed for anything. If you have to go to the bathroom, I don't give a shit. You are not going anywhere. But Dad, I have to go poop really really bad. Please. You got a minute to go. Yes, Dad. Thanks. Get upstairs. Okay. It doesn't even sound like you're pooping. You had better not be lying to me, mister. Dad, I am pooping. Well, very funny, because I don't even smell it. Maybe it's your stupid shitty ass nose. <coughs> don't you fucking talk to me like that. Get your fat ass up and get your ass back downstairs. Dad, I was really pooping. I had to go bad. Well, let's check it out. Well, Mike, you just lied to me again. <coughs> well, Mike, you are not grounded for even longer for fucking pretending to go to the bathroom. You are in so much fucking trouble. You are now having poop for three days. You hear me? Dad, I thought I had to poop. Don't you dare lie to me again, mister. You are so full of fucking lies. I can't tell whether it's the smell of your farts or your shit. Get your fat ass up and get your fucking ass downstairs. Dad, I thought I had to go but it was just some stupid big farts bubble. Well, sir, you just lied to me again. <laughs> Well, guess what, little boy? You now have a $500 charge for lying to me again. I am not fucking stupid, little boy. I heard you telling yourself that you were going to steal my car to your friends. Get your fat fucking ass up before I not only raise your charges, I will give you fucking poop for a fucking month. Get your fat fucking ass up, mister. Yes, dad. You get your ass at the table. <laughs> well, Mike, you now have a $100 charge for not responding to me. Oh my fucking god, Sam. I don't want a $100 charge. To fucking bad. Get your fat ass up, you fucking lying prick. Yes, bad. Sit your fat ass down. <laughs> well, guess what, little boy? Your charge has successfully raised to $200 instead for not responding to me again. Well, Sam, I don't have to respond to you. 
I am not saying fucking yes, Dad, anymore, you fucking pitsag. Get your fat ass here, mister. <laughs> well, sir, you now have a couple more charges. You are not grounded and getting charged $1,000 for car theft yet again. Well, Sam, I keep taking your fucking car because you fucking broke my car six years ago. I don't want to hear any more excuses. Get your fat ass back inside before I not only raise your charge, I will call the cops and your ass will be going to fucking prison. Get your fat ass up, mister, and get your ass inside. Yes, sir. You owe me $1,800. Yes, Dad. Now, Mike, would you like to tell me why you decided to try to sneak to your friend's house? You had better be honest with me before I kick your ass several times. I wanted to go to my friend's house because it's actually Peter's birthday today. He's expecting me in about 10 minutes. Well, guess what? You are not going anywhere. I don't give a shit if it's Peter's birthday. You are not going to your friends. Now get your ass back to bed. Dad, please. I will give you $30,000. But, Mike, I can't trust you anywhere. You are still not going. Get your ass in your bedroom like I said. And you had better not make one more excuse. You had better say yes, Dad. Dad, can you please give me one more chance? I will pay you double instead. That means $60,000 instead. Get your fat ass moving before I kick your ass. Please, please, please. Please give me a chance. He's expecting me in 10 minutes. <laughs> I told you not to make any more excuses. You are not grounded for another month for not listening. Get your fat ass into your bedroom before I not only kick your fat ass, I will give you fucking poop for a week. Get your fat ass moving this instant. Well guess what, motherfucker? I'm not giving you any more of my money. Get the fuck off of me before I fucking rape you. Don't you fucking sit there and threat my ass like that. You are not getting poop for a week. I told you several times to get in your fucking bedroom. Stop beating the fuck out of me. I wish you would just give me one fucking chance for once in your fucking life. It's my fucking friend's birthday and he's expecting me in five minutes. Please don't trap me in your house. I am your son and you should always let your son celebrate his friend's fucking birthday. That's it. You are grounded from your bedroom. No, Dad. Can I please have my last chance? That's an automatic extra week right there for asking me for a last chance. Dad, I want to celebrate Peter's birthday. Too bad. Not too bad. It's really important and I will always take his word for it. I promised him that I would be there. No matter how many times you say that, you are still not going anywhere. Get your fat ass into my bedroom before I not only ground your ass for another week, I will give you poop for a fucking year. Get your fat ass moving this second. Yes, Dad. You had better call your friend and tell him why you can't come. You have no idea how hard that's gonna be. You are the worst father I've ever had in my whole life. Well, too bad. Get your fat ass calling before I give you fucking poop for another week. And then I will ground you from your bedroom for 12 months. Get your fat ass calling your friend. I gotta go outside real quick.
Hey, Mike, what's up? Damon, my dad will not let me go to your house for Peter's party. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I am not. I've been trying to leave, but Sam keeps preventing me. I even offered $60,000 to Sam, but he still won't let me. Damn it. Let me talk to Sam, please. Okay. Sam, Devin wants to talk to you. Devin, I am not letting my son go anywhere, because he is grounded for good. Don't you fucking cuddle Shut him. Shut up. We are expecting him in five minutes and you aren't letting him. You had better let Mike leave before I come here and beat you up. Really? You wanna threat me again? You had better watch it, mister. I am not letting my son go anywhere. <laughs> Get your fat ass over here, mister. He he he. I stole my dad's telephone. I am hiding in the dog house. Yourself. No, Devin, this is Mike. I finally ran away from Sam's house. Meet me by the campfire. Hell yes, I will come pick you up in about five minutes. Good. Mike, you had better show yourself, mister. I am calling the cops in one minute if you don't get your fat ass back home. <laughs> 